Hey guys, today I'm going to show the most important Zaya tips and tricks that pro players use to carry their games. Zaya's Q has more range when you use it on walls. Her Q can deal damage to multiple opponents, but only the first target will take the most damage. So when trading with your opponents, try to hit them directly with Q. You can auto attack and use Q at the same time. This is an effective way to burst an enemy with low health. When you want to combine flash with Q, use Q first and then flash because the animation is faster. Her Q can be used through walls to deal damage to your opponents. Also, avoid facing walls when using Q on your opponents because the landing position of the feathers is weird. Her Q can be used to check the bushes for enemies. If you hit a hidden enemy there, you hear a specific sound. When you want to attack the enemy towers, use Zaya's W because it will increase your attack speed and you will be able to destroy them faster. When you use E, the hitbox of Zaya's feathers is bigger. You can use the auto attack Q trick to stun your opponents faster with E. When you want to stun an opponent who is out of range of your auto attacks, use Q on them, then auto attack a minion and then use E. You can use Fast to change the return direction of the feathers so you can stun multiple opponents. When your opponents are under the tower, try to poke them with Q and E because they will be focused to ask it your minions. Once you reach level 3, the basic trading combo is W, Auto Attack, Q, Auto Attack, E. Zayas R hitbox is more than the spell indicator. You can also use her ultimate rules to deal damage to your opponents. When you want to combine R with E to stun your opponents, avoid hitting them with the tip of R because sometimes E won't stun the target. When you activate her ultimate, you will only be able to use your summoner spells. When you want to combine flash with R, you can use R out of your opponent's vision and then flash to surprise them. You can use Zaya's ultimate to dodge enemy abilities. Her ultimate can also be used to check the bushes for enemies. If you hit a hidden enemy, you will see a specific animation. Once you reach level 6, the owing combo is R, E, W, Auto Attack, Q, Auto Attack. Also, you can use Gale Force to change the return direction of the feathers so you can stun multiple opponents. When you use Stopwatch, you will not be able to recast E until the Stopwatch effect ends. In teamfights, stay in the backline of your team and try to deal as much damage as possible to the closest enemies. Also, try to hit as many enemies as possible with your ultimate. If this video was useful to you, don't forget to like it.